Hello everyone, I hope you're having a lovely day. My name is Emma and welcome back to my YouTube channel. So today I'm gonna to be showing you how I use my water activated liners, specifically the Suva Beauty liners or any water activated liners. So if you're interested in how I use them, please continue watching. <laughs> So I have done all of my base makeup and eyebrows and everything like that because I am just going to be going in with some liner. I have I have set my eyelids, so no base on, just a little bit of concealer and I've set it with some powder and we're going to go in with our Suva Beauty liners. So I'll put my inspo on the screen beside right now so you guys can see. I'm going to be doing a bit of a butterfly inspired one, I think. Um, so we're just going to see how it goes. <laughs> So the products that I'm going to be using are the Suvi Beauty UV Taffies palette. Um, probably going to be using the shade Bubble Butt, which is like a pastel pink. And then also the Hydra Liners in the shade Scrunchy and Space Panda. So this is going to be like just a pink and white like graphic butterfly liner. Um, so I'm quickly going to sketch out the shape using an eye an, like an eyebrow pencil or something, just a light pencil so I get the shape before I start adding the liner. So I'm gonna do that and then I'll be right back. Okay, so I have lightly sketched out the shape. So it's really rough, but it's just kind of to follow when I put the liner on. So I'm gonna be using the Suvi Beauty um, brush i'm not actually sure what it's called but it came with a taffy's palette and it's really nice and tiny and thin perfect for graphic liner so i'm first going to go in with the shade space panda and i've just put some water in the lid and then you don't want it to make it too watery so i'm just dipping my brush into the water and then going to swirl that around in my liner and you can always test it like on the back of your hand to make sure it's the right consistency and everything so that is perfect and you can see that it's so pigmented as well so i'm going to use the white first and just follow the shape that i've already drawn and yeah that's just going to be kind of like our first line that we will build up on top of Okay, so I've just gone in with the Y and sketched out the first shape. And now I'm gonna try and make it a bit thicker on like the corners, like that bit there and that bit there, so that we can like perfect the shape before we add in the other colors. So now that we've perfected the Y, I'm now gonna go on to our baby pink shade, which is bubble butt from the UV Taffy's palette. So I've also mixed it with the water so we can see the color that we're going for. So it's this really beautiful baby pink shade. And now I'm gonna go above the white shade that we've just done and just follow the exact same line. I'm gonna start out really thin cause then I'll start to put like the thicker parts kind of around like the corners like there. And yeah, we're just gonna go with it and see what what happens. <laughs> so now our baby pink is done and I've already started to thicken up kind of the round edges. It's really hard to explain, but I've just thickened up here a little bit, that corner there, a little bit there, and then that last like round shape as well on like the second butterfly wing so now that we have added on that shade i'm going to go in with my final shade which is scrunchy from super beauty and i'm just going to follow the exact same line that i did with the baby pink and again making it thicker in kind of like the outer areas like the round corners you could say <laughs> Thank you. 
Okay, so now that we have the three colours down and I'm happy with the shape, I'm going to go back in with all three and just like perfect any of the lines. So some of it is going a bit thin where I was just kind of drawing out the lines. So now I'm just going to make sure that they're all really like defined as well. And I'm also going to repeat everything onto this eye. Okay, so we are back after about half an hour and I've completed this eye and also neatened up this side as well. And now all we have to do is add lashes and we are done. I have also added some of the Ofra Cosmetics All of the Lights highlighter into my inner corner and brow bone. So I'm going to put on some lashes and I'll be right back. Okay, so here we have our final look. I have just popped on some of the Unicorn Cosmetics lashes in the style Eternal. They're really long, wispy lashes. And remember, you can also use my code UCEMMA Ford for 10% off Unicorn Cosmetics lashes. I will also put all of my other discount codes and affiliate links down below in the description. And I've also popped in these gorgeous earrings from Shein. I think they fit the butterfly theme theme perfectly so yeah thank you so much again everyone for watching i really hope you guys enjoyed as always i'll put a close-up video at the end so you guys can see and please make sure that you subscribe like and comment and also check out my instagram at emma ford xo if you want to recreate this look as well please make sure that you tag me on instagram so i can see and also don't forget to put on the notification bell if you want to be notified every single time that I post on YouTube. I try to post on YouTube every single Sunday and I also post daily on Instagram. So please make sure to check that out as well. And I will see you in the next video. Bye bye.